This is the daily practice for Nepal's only contemporary circus, Circus Kathmandu. These youngsters have performed in numerous shows since the troops started around two years ago. Many people say that the circus is a bad thing. I used to think it would be so nice to have a circus here in Nepal, then people would get a good impression. The acts are fun, and not surprisingly, these children love their work. Things were not always this fun. All these children were rescued from circuses in India. They were trafficked there and were forced to work under harsh conditions. Back in 2006, this is where Sharmila used to be, in a circus in Uttar Pradesh, in India. Indian Supreme Court banned the use of children in circuses two years ago, but activists believe that there are still as many as 300 Nepali children working in Indian circuses. More than 300 Nepali children have already been rescued from circuses in India. Sharmila was 12 years old when she was rescued. She finds talking about her past too traumatizing. And according to Nepal Rescue Agency, many children struggle to readjust. Most of the children, they don't want to express they have really abused. Main problem is the memory problems. Many children, the education, they will be very, very weak because of the beating on the head, you know. They beat mostly on the head because on the body, if they beat, they can see the mark. For these children, Circus Kathmandu has given new hope. They are going to change the culture and history of circus in Nepal. Um, they, they're not aware of it, but it's the first circus company in Nepal, and uh, by, by just doing the work that they're doing, they're going to change people's perceptions of what circus is. So. And already with each performance, these children are doing just that. Trainers who volunteer with them say that they are now good to go and perform around the world. With luck, Circus Kathmandu will go global soon. Sabina Shreshta Al Jazeera, Kathmandu.